Hi everyone, Sean with jazbeescasebreaks.com here doing 2020 Panini Playbook Football 4 box break. Two random teams each, number 6. Where? 16 spots, everyone gets two random teams in NFL and all cards ship. Looking for really cool stuff like this, especially the booklets. So, here is our customer list from David Mallel down to Nicholas Bacello. Um, Danny C, Daniel C, if you're in here listening, watching this recording or whatever, and why your name is not on here, um, there was one person in the previously who had requested a refund in the break, so we had refunded it, and I think we added a spot back in as well. So it doubled up. You were the last spot that was purchased, so that spot was refunded. Just a heads up. Um, but Nicholas Pacella with uh, got the official last spot, so he's got last spot mojo there. Uh, the teams from the Arizona Cardinals down to the Washington football team. Since every spot gets you two teams, we need to copy this list and double it up. There you go. So you've got last spot mojo there with Nicholas once and twice. So dice roll to randomize both lists. Four and a five, nine times. It's a pretty good mixer. 2020 Bowman Draft. Spencer Torkelson, Max Meyer, and then 2019 Bowman Chrome HTA. I'm a big fan. You know I love Bowman. So nine times on that randomizer there. Nine times on the dice. From Kevin, back down to Patrick. And now nine times on the teams. Ninth and final time. From the Colts down to the Giants. So, Kevin Mahoney with the Colts, Nicholas Bacello with the Falcons, David Mallel with the Chiefs, Mike Nicholas Bacello with the Raiders, Jonathan Arnaldi with the Cardinals, Roy Sapic with the Giants, Gus F. with the 49ers, Brian Giacoma with the Steelers, Dayton Rogers with the Cowboys, John McCall with the Jaguars, Vincenzo Perea with the Chargers, Larry Jensen with the Dolphins, David Mallel with the Saints, Brian Giacoma with the Lions, Vincenzo Perea with the Eagles. John McCall with the Ravens, Gus F. with the Browns, Stephen Lee with the Jets, Larry Jensen with the Bears, David Mallell with the Washington football team, Dayton Rogers with the Packers, Stephen Lee with the Seahawks, uh, Nicholas Bacello with the Texans, Jonathan Arnaldi with the Bengals, Brennan Vandom with the Wait, Titans. How, you, how are you saying Nicholas's last name? Nicholas Bacello. You're going Bacello? Bacello. Is it, are you saying Bacello? Uh, that's not even right. I, I, would, I would go with Nicholas Bacello no. or Bacello. 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 Bacello? Yeah, I'm going Bacello. Nicholas Bacello with the Bills. I say if it's Italian, it's 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 <laughs> Bucello. In Italian, it's Bucello. Yeah, but I. It's it's Bucello. Okay, what are you saying then? But Americanized would be Bucello. But you say Bucello? Like Bucello. I feel like that's like Bucello. the third pronunciation. Bucello. 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 See? Okay. Yeah. Well, see, it's it's Nicholas Bucello. You gotta give that. And this, how do you how do you say uh, the person who has the Eagles? Let me see. Where's the Eagles? Where are they at? Right Vin there. Vincenzo Perea. That's yeah, Vincenzo. Come Vincenzo on. Vincenzo Perea. Vincenzo? No one says Vincenzo. Vincenzo. That's, that's Vincenzo. Vincenzo. Yeah. Okay. Come on. Okay. Let's get, let's okay. get into the Italian spirit here. So, back to the list. Uh, Brennan Vandom with the Titans. <laughs> Nicholas Buccello with yeah. the Bills. Brennan Vandom with the Vikings. David Mallel with the Buccaneers. Kevin Mahoney Forza with the Patriots. Buccello. Okay, what about this? Is it Roy Zapik? It's Zappic, right? Yeah, that I don't know. Roy Zappic. No, I have no opinion on that. Rams. <laughs> That's a tough one. <laughs> Patrick Sullivan with the Broncos and the Giants. There you go. Um, is it Scene or Sean? It's Scene. Whatever, whatever, <laughs> it's scene. whatever the most people call me, I'm okay with. <laughs> so there is the full list. Trade window is open. Um, let's see. I think. Uh, Jonathan Singh and trying to get the Bears. Will there be more plates and patches? I hope so. We'll see. No, that was our last plates and patches. Okay, never mind. For now. Always for now. Um, I mean, if we do get more, the price might be a little bit higher.
Did you see anything on the uh, Bears package for Deshaun Watson? No. Apparently? This is a. Is this some kid on Twitter? No, 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 no. This is like, legit. This is like this is legit. Ian Rappaport has actually heard I haven't something. heard pieces to it, but there was multiple people that said, listen, nobody is going to offer more than what the Bears just offered the Texans. So if the Texans don't accept this trade, they are not going to trade. Well, then he's going to sit out. Yes. They have to trade. Just tear the Band-Aid off. They got it. So what was the Bears offer? I don't know. I haven't seen any reports on it yet, but I'm, I'm I mean, from is what this, like is this a legit rumor that's coming yeah. out of the front office? Like front office sources have said. Yes. Interesting. Apparently they they are like this is legit. Like so. Um, give it another thirty seconds on trade. Jonathan's trying to get the Bears. So if uh, Larry is here listening, watching. I know that they can't offer what the Jets can offer, Nick, but at the same point, like, are the Jets really going to offer what the Bears are willing to offer? Do you know what I mean? It's not like that the Bears have the best package available. It's that the Bears may be offering the best package, unfortunately. Jonathan's now saying, anybody want the Cardinals? So, okay, Mojo, you've, you've bought into the potential that they are going to trade him now. I'm still saying Dolphins. Okay, 10 more seconds, and then we're going to close out the trade window, Jonathan. Doesn't look like anybody else is here talking about trades. Three, two, and one. Trade window closed. We're going to print rip. You hate Arizona. Kyler Murray is going to come up and give you an autograph right now and haunt your dreams forever. <laughs> and then you're going to love Arizona. What just happened? Do we need to disconnect? Oh no, we're good. Okay. I don't get that though, Mojo. I really don't get that. Why would you want to go to San Francisco? Good luck, everybody. Here's our final list. Mike Williams, two thirty six out of two ninety nine. For the Chargers, Vincenzo Vincenzo Perea, Antonio Gibson, 65 out of 99 for David Millel and the Washington football team, Roquan Smith, Otto for the Bears, Larry Jensen, he's pretty exceptional, and Rookie signature locker. Very nice. KJ Hamler. We got three colors in the bottom right, two in the middle left, and two on the top right for the Denver Broncos and Patrick Sullivan. That is 68 out of 99. Nice booklet there. Christian Kirk, 64 out of 299 for the Cardinals. Jonathan Arnaldi, tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Three color patch, five out of 25. Van Jefferson for the Rams. Roy Zappick. Nice. 
Nikhil Harry for the Patriots. Kevin Mahoney. What is this thing? It's hilarious. Oh, it's a documentary on the on on the inside of the NBA. Nice. This is actually pretty cool. I, yeah, it's actually kind of fun. And I mean, apparently, there's like a it's a multi part series. So. J.K. Dobbins, jersey and auto for the Baltimore Ravens. John McCall. Fifty out of one ninety nine. Just kidding. Just kidding, Dobbins. Just kidding, Dobbins. I'm not gonna lie, this feels like something that they would air after Ernie Johnson passed away. You know what I mean? Or like, like, an, in, like an in memoriam type thing? Or after like the season. Seems like an off season kind of thing, but. It's... Yeah. I, mean, I, can't, I can't believe how long this show's been around. Like, it's. Kind of crazy. Michael Gallup, 50 out of 149 for the Cowboys, Dayton Rogers. Jumbo Relic, 20 out of 199. Jacob Eason for the Colts, Kevin Mahoney. Jersey and Otto, 56 out of 199. Benny Snell Jr. For Pittsburgh Steelers, Snell Yeah. Brian Giacoma. And Clyde Edwards Elair, Jersey and Auto for the Kansas City Chiefs and David Malo. That is ninety seven out of ninety nine. And last box. Good luck, everybody. Jeremy Chin, rookie auto, 43 out of 49. For the Carolina Panthers, Roy Zappick. I like him. Donovan Peoples Jones, 50 out of 75. Go blue, Michigan grad or Michigan alum. 50 out of 75 for the Cleveland Browns, Gus F. Devin Bush, another Michigan grad or alum. Steelers, Brian Jacoma. And final booklet, Clyde Edwards Elaire again. Jumbo booklet relic. That is 33 out of 70 for the Chiefs again and David Malau. There you go, David. Congrats. Nice little break for you. And there you go, guys. That was the four boxes. That was 2020 Panini Playbook Football four box break. Number six, two random teams each from jaspyscasebreaks.com. I'm Sean, jaspyscasebreaks.com. Thanks for hanging out, and we'll see you next time.